how Shelbyville police are hoping this new sketch can help them find a man accused of trying to sexually assault a woman. Our Alan Carter has been looking into what happened since police released this picture a few hours ago. He is live tonight from Shelbyville High Apartments. Alan? That's right, Jenny. It's been nearly three weeks now that police have been looking for a suspect in this attempted sexual assault that happened in the apartment building behind me here. But now today they've released the sketch of the person that they believe may be responsible for this act. This is another look at him. Shelbyville police posted this on their Facebook today. They say the man is a black man about five foot five with a skinny build dark hair and tattoos. The incident itself happened at the Shelbyville High Apartments back on August 13th. Police not releasing much about specifics of what happened, but as you can imagine, word of this incident has traveled fast and has people taking notice. Yeah, I have a 14-year-old son, so, you know, this neighborhood when we moved here 19 years ago was great and well-maintained, and it still is, but personally, I think the apartments have really really drag it down. It makes me more aware of what's going on now, so that way I can protect my family. And at the time of the attempted assault, police say the man was wearing blue jeans and a sleeveless shirt. If you have any information about this incident, you're asked to call Shelbyville Police. Reporting live in Shelbyville, Ellen Carter, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. All right, Alan, thank you.